Welcome to the Swan Station, and welcome to the new Swan Station segment, Ellie's Art Corner. And I'm super excited today because we are going to be doing a drawing tutorial on how to draw a lavender oil bottle with some lavender behind it. I've got all the materials, and I'm ready to go. So of course, the first thing you need is a piece of paper, because you can't draw without a piece of paper. You need a pencil to do sketching, and your line work before you actually make it a real picture. You need a felt tip pen. I would suggest felt tip as tiny as you can get it so it doesn't bleed. And then I also have this big case of pencils that I'm gonna use for shading and stuff like that. I'm gonna color this. You don't have to color this, but I'm gonna color it. So I'm gonna move my pencils aside. For vibrant colors, I've got all these pens. So the first thing you wanna do, I have an oil bottle. It's a room of sleep, but it doesn't matter. As long as I get the general detail of what it looks like. If it looks like it's a good place to be on a picture, then that's how you should hold it, and that's how you should copy it onto your piece of paper. So I'm just gonna do that. So I get how big it is. So sometimes I just trace it like this. So when you are drawing, the first thing you wanna do is sketch it. When you first start, you do it really light. So now that I've got the general shape of it, I'm gonna start sketching. The first thing I'm gonna sketch is the main body area right here. Kind of like a round square when it's on paper. I'm gonna start with two lines. They should be as straight as you can get them, but it doesn't matter if, if it's not, if you're giving this as a gift or as a card, it's what the thought, it's the thought that counts, right? So you don't have to get it perfect, but straight lines would be suggested for something like this. Um, so then with this oil bottle, you see the edges of the oil bottle are kind of rounded. You can see like the roundness right there and like the roundness right there. You can see like the curve. Right, so that's what we're gonna try to do. So I would just suggest doing a curve. Imagine as if it was a dolphin. Yeah, that's how I would do it. Imagine as if it was a dolphin, curving it out of the water, jumping out, having fun. On the top, it's more curvy than the bottom. The bottom is little animated, so I'm just gonna do tiny, tiny curves. And then I'm going to do a line. So now that you've got this kind of it's weird, I know, it's weird. It's just like a little bottle shape. So I am going to now do the cap. There's this weird little thing, so I'm gonna try to draw that. I'm gonna try to get those right. Now I'm just making the cap. It's half the size of the bottle. It's also rounded at the edges. And now, at the top of the bottle, I'm going to make these little rivets. Okay, so now that's that done, I'm gonna do the label, which is sort of like a ribbon shape. I'm making little labels. So then, after that, you're just gonna add the lavender. I would say you need three sticks of lavender. So that's where the lavender is going to be. Lavender is like little short stubs of lavender on a stem. So you're gonna do tiny leaf, tiny leaf, and it just getting bigger and bigger. It's kind of like hearts with a stem in the middle. I'm just gonna add some accents. So once you're done with that, you're basically all done. You just need to mark it down with your felt tip. Make sure all the lines are smooth and ready to color. Now all you do is erase the line. Now, if you weren't coloring this, this would be done for you. But if you are coloring it, then go ahead and color it how you want.
And that's all you had to do. I hope you had a great time drawing your oil bottle. So this is the end of the tutorial. Remember to like if you want to see more and make sure to subscribe if you want to see us make more videos. I'll see you next time at the Art Corner. Bye!